All right, welcome back, everybody. Uh, today we're going to be reviewing the differences between the Magpul field case and the Magpul bump case. Uh, as we all know, the field case is a very cheap alternative for a case. It will get the job done for the basic abrasions and uh, drops. But the thing is that even though it is made of a similar TPU material or polycarbonate material as the Magpul PMAGs, they're very soft and very uh, flexible. Whereas the field or the bump case, sorry, is a solid piece where if you tap the diff you can hear the difference in the tapping sound. So let's see. Uh, the bump case is much more rigid and much more uh, uh, durable because it has an inner inner lining with these uh, little gray tabs right here. If we can focus it, that help. Uh, keep the phone from being uh, too roughed up while it's inside. All right. The biggest difference why one would go with the field case or a pump case is the price. Uh, field case is usually only about somewhere between 10 to $15 depending where you buy it. Whereas the bump case usually tends to run you more expensive somewhere between the range of uh, 25 to almost $30. And I'm going to slowly pan down for this so you guys can read it. All right, let's see how the actual case looks like and compare the inside and the outside. All right, now that we got the phone case out or the phone case out of its box, let's put this aside for now and take a better look at these two. Uh, the MacBook field cases would not come with this uh, in the highlighted. I did that myself. Uh, so right off the bat, you can tell one is much harder and you can see the field case can be pressed in easily, whereas the uh, bump case does not flex at all. On the inside though, the uh, field case is basically just a very uh, basic polycarbonate TPU material that is in here, whereas the MacBook bump case focus, has this inner lining which is a soft touch material but very very uh, durable. And they're both made by the same company obviously and they're both made in the USA. Um, I didn't see any videos online about the differences or the how how you can spot the differences. Is obviously when you buy it, you know the standard one is called the Magpul Field Case, and also uh, it does not have these uh, grayish tab linings that the bump case has. Obviously, also is on the packaging. It says bump case instead of field case. Let's see if that focuses, right? Um, and also, you can tell if you know, if it, even if the field case had a box that says bump case, you can look on the inside. If it's not gray, because all of them are standard gray on the inside, and then the outside of the uh, the case is what is colored. All right. So, big reason why I bought the Magpul bump case now is because as good as the TPU or the standard field case is, this lasted me a good six months. Um, but then eventually it started to you know loosen up and it started getting loose around all the corners and then this part was able to like stretch out. Uh, I did do the boiling method, boiling water method which is you put boiling water, you put this in there real quick, let it shrink and then you dip it into cold water to shrink it and firm it up. But uh, the, the method also kind of warps the, the case slightly as you can see it's slightly angled now. Uh, versus the bump case where it's a solid material it's not gonna form flex or 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 anything like that um, I'm gonna try this form case this case out we'll see how it goes in the future uh, I would I would put my phone in here right now to test how it looks or feels and everything but <laughs> I'm using my phone right now to record it so I cannot do that but anyways, uh, thank you for watching, guys. Um, I know there's not been many videos about this specific case out there because most people associate this case with that case, although they're completely different. All right, well, thank you guys for watching, and don't forget to subscribe, and I'll catch you next time.